Investigation. That's not a lawful order. I'm using my First Amendment right to film. You're recording or texting? I'm filming. Okay. So, obviously, the description came out, look, this grabbed you, and you have to And we have someone who's going to come over here and say that you did it. Your okay? description is someone with brown hair. That's what you want me to say. You're not under arrest. So, am, I, am I free to go? No, you're not. You're, you're being detained. detained. Okay. Under what okay. grounds? What? Under what grounds? It's criminal mischief. You're identifying as a person who's committed criminal mischief. Well, lots of people meet the description. That guy meets the description. That guy meets the description. That guy meets the description. Okay, so after, I don't see you harassing so, any of the other people so that fit the description. So after we're done, we'll go talk to them. Well, you're letting some of them walk away right now. I'm talking to you. Because I believe it's you. I don't believe it's them. Simple as that. I'm going to exercise my right to remain silent now. Okay. Go ahead. I'm exercising my right to remain silent. I will continue exercising that right until I have a lawyer. To do what? I will continue exercising my remi right, right to remain silent until I have a lawyer. But you're talking now. Yes, I I'm informing you that I'm exercising my right to remain silent. I walk off the street now. So you want to talk to me about that, or you want to talk to me about anything else? Is that correct? Uh, no, I, I, I just can't legally carry a conversation with you because you have the legal ability to lie and I don't. Actually, I so it's an unfair kind of... No, it's true. You guys can actually lie in an investigation to get whatever answers you want. Well, I was asking about your chalk. You said yourself it's not illegal to have the chalk. I was asking about the chalk. And I'm not answering because I'm issue I'm a I'm enacting my right to remain silent. Did I do something to upset you? Like I said, it's an unfair. I can't hold a conversation with you. It's an unfair playing field. So the answer would be no. You neither acknowledge me or disacknowledge Step out of the street. It's actually not even criminal effects. You understand that? 6839. Yeah. William, 6839. Do you understand that? I'm going to reenact my right to remain silent. Okay. But did you know that was illegal? Did you know that? Did you not know that? You're shaking, are you okay? Are you upset? Uh, sir, I'm going to have to ask you to wait right here. Be right back. Apparently. The four of us, I guess, are detained. What? The four of us, I guess, are detained. 
Oh, you are too? Yeah. Do you still live on Amherst Drive? Amherst? Yes, according to your driver's license, you live at 2101 Amherst Drive. There's no R. Amethyst, I apologize, thank you. Yes. You still live there in Killeen, Texas? From time to time. Is that your current address? Is my master? Well, I have several current addresses. Do you know that that is part of the fail to identify court of law? Well, I said that's an address of mine, but I have several. No, is that your current address? You have to it's one current of my address. current addresses. You have more than one current address? Yes. Where did you stay at last night? Um, see, last night I stayed in my car, so. You stayed in your car. Okay. But do you have legal residence at Amethyst? Yes. They haven't said anything to you. They haven't told you to leave. You can be here. I think the three hasn't waited until we left. Yeah. So for you turning in, I've been detained by police for now. So we're just gonna wait around here and see what happens. They tried to arrest you because you looked like someone that they thought was... So, right now I've been informed that I'm being detained because I matched the description of a individual with brown hair. Long brown hair. Yeah. And what was the charge against that person? I think they said criminal mischief. For... Uh -uh. Okay. 
Actually, you only have to ID when you're being charged, unless you're driving a motor vehicle. Um, excuse me, Officer Lynch, if I may. He technically doesn't have to ID unless he's already being charged with something or driving a motor vehicle. Yes. A brake? Yes. Not a brake. This is a street. Okay. Yeah. This has been labeled a street for a long time. Yes, I know this is a street. Apparently, they do a list of some map. Oh. And I cannot remember the old name, the name of the old street. This building of the street. So right now you're going to be coming right. You're not going to receive a citation today. But well, you do know you told me to stand there at, before my detainment. Well, you ran down the street. That was when you were in the roadway. Hmm. That's when you were in the roadway. That's what I was citing. Hmm. However, being as I cannot find this label on the map right now. And there's no street sign. It could be argued that you were good. Because, because when you originally said that, uh, when that, I, you you, yeah, you said you were st you were standing right there. Don't you know that's illegal? So you were referencing to the the fact of me standing. You never said anything about me running. Does that matter? I'm just. That's why I was referencing. I'm asking you. I'm just that saying matter? that. I'm just I'm saying that's why I was referencing the standing. I'm asking. Because that's what you brought up. I'm asking. Well, it's not whether you're running, standing, walking, jogging, nothing like that. It's pedestrian in the roadway is what the citation is called. Mm. So, yeah. you well, could be doing handstands in the street. And that's illegal. Looks like an alley to me, but... Well, actually, it is a street. You see this building right here, this brown building? Yeah. It has a label of 601. Mm. And it used to have the street name on it. However, they, they removed it recently. And I do not remember the name of the street. Oh. That's a so at this point, this is still a street. That's why there's parking signs. Huh. However, at huh. this time, there is no name of the street. You're not going to be receiving a citation. Hmm. What is your phone number? 254 290 1619. 250 4. 254 290 290 1619. So do you, were you in the military? Is that why you're clean? I'm just asking you just a conversation. I, 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 again, I prefer to not. Did I do something to upset you? No, but I, I'm just, I prefer not to. I was just making conversation. I know. Come on. And you don't like making conversation? I, I mean, I love making conversation, but I don't want to uh, potentially incriminate myself for anything. You being in the military, no, no criminal implications at all. I mean, on the surface, yes, but maybe potentially you could use that in court for something else. Are you originally from Flint? Do you happen to? Are you from Victoria at all? Again, I'm not going to. I'm just you gonna. I'm just question. gonna exercise my right to remain silent for the rest of this. Fair enough. So they have loaded one individual up in the paddy wagon, and they are taking his bag now. Oh, uh, well, you're just sitting in the side.
Kit, did we get his name? No, no, not your names. His name. So we have a second arrest, probably for the failure to ID. Those of you just turning in, I've been detained by Austin Police Department. They say I fit the description of an individual that they want. I just, I can't call, I can't carry a conversation with you. No. If for my legal best interest, I cannot carry a conversation with you. So if I had to see him off, would you talk to me? Hmm? If I had to see him off, would you talk to me? Depends on the situation, maybe. Walking down the street, you carrying chalk. I mean, me, no you, you, have, you have to understand that the situation that I am, you hold all the cards, I hold only a few of the cards, and one of those cards is to not talk to you. So, so you, ha you hold all the power in this situation, and so I am exercising the little power that I have in this situation, and that is that I am not going to engage in dialogue with you.
Again, I am currently detained by Austin Police Department. There have been two arrests made so far. We have the paddy wagon out. They're detaining several of us, and they're waiting. To, we're waiting to see what they do. Officially not detained anymore. So APD has decided to take all the chalk. Alright. Officer Sanchez! Um, we don't have the name of the, the older gentleman who was just arrested. Is it possible to get his name? It's, it's, it's important that we know his name. Thank you. I, I, don't, I don't know. I couldn't Supposedly he had warrants. What about the first guy? So we can't help them in either situation. So we have two individuals that were arrested for um, prior warrants that they had upon de detainment by APD. A bunch of us, several of us got detained and we've been released apparently. But they are taking the chalk that we had and confiscating it. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Can we have that to Yeah, I can yes. see that. Um, Sarah, the six are All right. Sarah, um, the name of the other gentleman who was arrested is Lynn Foster, L-Y-N-N. -N. I got it. Apparently, uh, both of the individuals who were arrested have warrants, so I don't know what there is that can do for them other than jail support. Um, also, we believe that uh, Lynn was arrested. Uh, so they and arrested the chalk. I'll finish safe. Uh, we didn't get his name. You can't get the chalk back. Oh, no, they're going to Travis County, bro. Wait, so they said that they took the chalk. Yeah, they took the chalk. It's going to be doing the night. They took the chalk. So they're stealing our personal property. They, they've released us because... They released, they released us because obviously they didn't have enough probable cause to arrest either one of us, but for some reason they're still stealing our property. I mean, they can't just steal our property if we're not being arrested. Well, um, I will say, as someone that said, hey, to let the property be taken by APD, they can take it, and then what, what they do is, is they give you a, a sort of like thing, and then you can go back and get it. So we have three or four bullhorns that are in this. Uh, we are... Um, all right, so again, there were two, uh, several of us were detained by APD. Um, yeah, that's cool. Several of us were detained by APD. There were two arrests for individuals that apparently had previous warrants. Um, when their information was looked up in the system. Um, the rest of us have been released from detainment. No justice, no peace, abolish APD! No justice, no peace, abolish APD! Okay, right. Chant of one right there.
probably just distracted. So I, I live streamed my entire detainment. <laughs> oh, oh, wait, oh, so you were detained. Oh, yes, I was detained. Oh. I, wasn't, I wasn't gonna stay if they had let me go. I said I might detain, and they said yes. Because Sarah, um, Sarah was like, I heard rumor that Gloria's been detained. I tweeted her that I've been detained. Oh, and, I, and she goes, can you, just, can you confirm that? And I couldn't actually see you. Because Canales was in the way, mm. and so I was, so I had to move, and I was like, I don't think so. He's just kind of chilling on the fence. No, no, no. That's how, that's how I get detained. I chill on a fence. <laughs> chill. Just like the chill act style of detainment. Uh, I, I thought you were just like, you were like filming away or whatever. No, no, no. I, I was actually detained. They took my ID and read my info and everything. You, hey, y'all, do you want to hang out on my chair? It's really fucking heavy, so... It was. Like, my chair doesn't matter. Yeah, I'm gonna take my bag, though, because I... Here, let's hang out on my chair. Swap in my house, yeah. Sure. Take my 400 pounds, I might as well use it. So that was fun. What's your name? Uh, Daniel. Daniel. Sorry. I also go by Agony. Agony. Yeah. Uh, did they do it you too? Yes. Yeah, I was trying to figure They said that we fit the description of a male with brown hair. Oh. That was their, their oh. that was their reason for detaining us, is that we were males with brown hair. And it's like there's all kinds of males with brown hair walking by, and you're not detaining them. Nathan Green. Nathan Green. Nathan Mud. Nathan we, Green. we matched the description of somebody green. 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 No, Green was the guy. Green is not. Steve Royal says ten people were at the ten cops and Spellman were at the plaza taking pictures of the talk. Huh. Um, Spellman. I wonder how many books he All right, so I'm going to shut stream off for now. We're going to head to DA. So we're probably going to be late, but unforeseen circumstances.